Here's how you can improve your videos and photography using the iFootage 40 degrees projector lens. I'll show you how you can shape the light, create amazing backgrounds, and where to use it in general. Very briefly, if you don't know what a projector lens or a spotlight mount is, it's basically like putting a lens in front of your light, similarly to a camera lens, where you can adjust the focus. So let's start off with how to get these amazing, interesting backgrounds. You can attach the spotlight modifier to your bounce mount light. And if you have a smaller light with a mini bounce mount, you can also uh, use this modifier using an adapter. Put any of the included 12 gobos, which is short for go-betweens, into this gobo holder. Slide it into this slot and you're good to go. You can focus the lens so that you get a sharper pattern. Unfocus it slightly to get a more blurry background and create more depth in your videos or pictures. Or unfocus it completely if you want a more abstract background. Some of the more popular gobos to create a more realistic look are Venetian blinds to create a fake window light, a fake window shape, and this tree pattern. My favorite at the moment uh, is the Lines Go Bow, which I'm using right now. If you don't use this light modifier with an RGB light, you can still change the color of the light by simply putting any of the included five gels inside this gel holder and attach it to the front of the projector lens. The good thing about this projector lens being 40 degrees is that you can use it in smaller spaces like I'm doing right now. Because if the lens is more narrow, you'd need much more space as the beam angle is smaller and you need to put it much further away from the wall. So the 40 degrees lens has wider usage while a wider angle lens like a 20 degrees lens is more suitable for larger spaces. By the way, a 20 degrees lens will be be available from iFootage in the near future and as it is a more narrow lens it will also produce slightly sharper shapes just for your information. You can shape the light using these four blades creating squares, triangles, lines and more which is a great way to create a dramatic look and it's also great for product photography. Now speaking of product photography, if you need to be even more precise and create an even smaller dash of light, you can get yourself this iris ring and create very small and precise spots of light. You can also use this iris ring from further away uh, if you again need to light a small and specific area. Now as you can shape the light and get small and sharp shapes, sharp shapes. You can use this projector lens as a bounce light either from a wall or the ceiling which is great in case you can't mount a light exactly where you want to. And as you can get pin sharp shapes with this light modifier you can create a unique look using a smoke or a haze machine where you can see the shape easier than using for example a Fresnel lens. Now this is great for music videos and for example short films. When you buy the iFootage projector lens, you also get this uh, kind of soft hard case. It's very well padded, so you can safely bring your projector lens and its accessories back and forth to shoots. So all of this can be yours for the reasonable price of 349 US dollars, and you can get the iris ring for an additional 59 bucks. This 40 degrees projector lens is one of my favorite accessories for these bow and mount lights. It's very well built. The 40 degrees lens is easier to use for most creators. And compared to other spotlight mounts out there, $349 is a solid investment as it's an accessory you can use for so many different things. Now, if you still don't have a light for this projector lens or if you want to update your existing light, you need to check out this video right here as it's one of my favorite lights ever. Go and check that one out. Peace.